What's up YouTube? This is Demkeys back again with another Unity tutorial and today I will be teaching you about halos. Halos are light areas around light sources. They are used to give the impression of small dust particles in the air. An example would be at night if you look at the street lamp you'll see a glow around the light and there will be dust particles over there. I guess that would be a good example of a halo. Okay, so let's begin. What we have in our scene is a plane and our first person controller. I'm going to add a point light to the scene and change its color to... I have made a preset over here. Yeah, this color. and let me create a material and call this bulb mat and I'm going to add a sphere to the scene this is going to be our bulb Then just drag the bulb onto the sphere and also make the point light a child of sphere. So you can then just make all these values zero and center it um, within the sphere. Alright, so there are two ways that you can draw halos. One way would be to check draw halo. What happens in this case is the halo is going to use the color that you have selected for the light. It's You cannot set your own color in this case. And if you want to control how big the halo is, you can change the halo strength value from render settings. You can also change this value using script. I'll show you that a little while later. Over here in the inspector it only goes up to a max of 1 but through script if you increase it goes quite far. Okay this is one way. Another way would be to add a halo component. So, add component, effects, halo. The benefit of this is you can have a, a halo color that is independent of the light's color. You don't have to, your halo doesn't necessarily have to be of the same color as the light. Like, maybe you might, for whatever reason, you might want to have a halo of a different color than your light. So in that case this would be very useful. Like this. Or maybe go with something darker. You can also change the size. Unfortunately I haven't found a way to change these values through script. I tried my best but I just cannot find a way to access the halo component from the script. So if any of you know how to do that then just let me know. Okay there is one more thing I forgot to show you. Let's disable this halo component and check draw halo. Now select edit render settings and let's take a look at halo texture halo texture is basically how the halo is going to be displayed now I don't have a good understanding of how these textures work but uh, based on what I've noticed 
the halo only picks up lighter colors off of whatever texture you put or whatever texture you set so you can notice lighter colors over here are being shown whereas black is all just transparent same with this same with this and over here all this is white and so that's being shown whatever is black is transparent so I guess you can make your own uh, shape of halo <coughs> But yeah, I just wanted to point this out. I will show you how to change the halo strength value through script. Create a new script, call it halo script 02. create a public float variable called multiplier This is basically going to tell us whether we are pressing the left key or the right key. Next, render settings dot halo strength plus equals h. Okay, so what's going to happen is if we have pressed left, then the value that input.getAccess is going to give us is negative 1 and if we have pressed the right key then we'll get positive 1 whatever the value is it will be multiplied by multiplier we're going to set this value to say 0 0.01 and then the the entire the the, the total and then the total will be added or subtracted from hello strength so let's save the script and add it to the light I guess you can add it to any to any of the objects in the scene because it's just supposed to pick up which keys you're pressing so I don't think it matters set this value to 0 0.01 bear in mind halo component is not being used over here we are using the other method of creating a halo alright so let's play the game Well, here the character is moving, so I think I should show it to you in the scene view. So yeah, this is how you use halos. I hope this tutorial was helpful. Do check out these other videos as well. The video on the top left teaches you about layers and layer masking. The video on the top right teaches you about fixing object rotation. And the video on the bottom left teaches you how to use a wheel collider. I'm also accepting donations. So if you would like to help me out, you can send your donations to my PayPal email address, which is mentioned on the screen and in the description down below.
don't forget to like share and subscribe leave your comments below and i'll see you guys next time is he even still the same claiming lord's boys but we never seen him main i don't cover now i am when he get the chance to hang like damn 134 niggas acting like i never been through them doors moved up town and i rocked a little red niggas asking me for raw cuz i'm out in hipstead like shit who are you entourage member or